This demonstrated that the beds or strata did not form one at a time as required by the principle of superposition. The speed of the water current started at one meter per second and gave rise to a deposit of microstrata or laminae prograding downstream. The flow of the current was then reduced to half a meter per second. This provoked the deposit of large particles of sediment. Then, as the deposit thickened, the speed of current was increased back to one meter per second and laminate deposited on the large particles. So the deposit was composed from top to bottom of beds or strata of small particles, large particles and small particles. This demonstrated that the beds or strata did not form one at a time as required by the principle of superposition. They formed simultaneously nor did any one bed have the same age at any point as required by the principle of continuity because they formed together and sideways. Here we have a phenomenon of multiple beds of sediment forming on top of each other vertically and sideways at the same time, the triggering mechanism having been simple changes of current 